Mr. Kuykendall here with this week's principles update. First, a attendance. Um, I know a number of you have gotten attendance letters. Um, you, those letters were received if you had three or more absences up to this point in the school year in any particular period. Um, these are all based on ed code. I know the letters do sound a little harsh, but uh, there is more information on the website if you're interested about that. If we do have concerns, we will make sure to be following up with you after those letters about your attendance. Also, more on a positive note, we have the Rolling Hill States Holiday Parade right around the corner just a week out from 6 to 7.30. Um, that goes all around Peninsula Center and uh, the promenade there. Our own very own marching band will be in it, so hopefully you can come down and support them and support the parade. It's a great event. Also, today is the final day of the first trimester, so be checking uh, online for final grades, and if you have any questions, make sure to reach out to those teachers directly. And with the final end of the first trimester comes the start of the second trimester on Monday. All new schedules will be given during their first period class, so students report to their normal first period class, and then if there are any changes from them, they will go. But you will get new schedules um, on Monday during your first period class. Don't forget, next week we have a shortened week. Monday and Tuesday normal schedules, but Wednesday will be a minimum day and no school on Thursday and Friday due to the Thanksgiving holiday. As you can see, I'm wearing the USC garb. We had USC UCLA Spirit Day today. A lot of fun. Tug of wars at lunch. Unfortunately, UCLA won two rounds to one, so we'll see if that's reflected in the game tomorrow. Um, but fight on Trojan fans. I'll be rooting for you tomorrow. Also, on a lighter note, we do have our sweatshirts here. These are our Ridgecrest Design sweatshirts. Order forms are found online and in the main office. Get those in. We just have a few weeks before orders are closed for this year. We hope to get those uh, orders placed um, prior to winter break. And finally, my Raiders of the Week. I have two of them. Ioni Ogawa, who drew this, and Margaret Gao. Like, how impressive. Honestly, I, I, I can't say enough great things about our art department and about our talented students. Great job, ladies. Incredibly proud of you. That's all we have for this week. I hope everyone has a great week, and go Raiders!